What's going on, my ASVAB party people? I'm Anderson, your ASVAB coach, and I got a question for you. Do you know all of the different types of questions that you'll see on the paragraph comprehension? Did you even know there was more than one type? Here's the thing. Paragraph comprehension is much, much, much more than just reading passages and answering questions. There's a little more detail in it, and you have to know the different types of questions that you might face. That way you have a strategy for each and every single one. So if you want to make things easy, keep watching this video. But before you do, make sure to please like this video and subscribe to the channel. Go ahead and do it. And tonight at 6 p.m., we're going to be hosting a class on paragraph comprehension. And you can use that link right there, the link up here, or the description to go ahead and check out my full program to join. All recordings are included, and you'll get my support all the way till you pass. But without further ado, let's go ahead and smack this. Let's see what's up. So the question reads, which of the following, and let me stop right there. Why did I start with the question? Why did I start here? Well, the thing is, my party people, you want to and need to start with the question because if you start up here, all you're doing is just reading information. Do you know why this information is useful yet? Do you know what you're supposed to be answering? What you're looking for? Not yet, right? And that's why it's so important to start with the question because the question gives you direction. It tells you, hey, look, this is the objective. Now go ahead and read all that information and see how it can be useful to you. So there we go. Which of the following represents the correct sequence of events? That's the, the question type that we're dealing with right here, sequence of events. So this is a common type of question on the ASVAB paragraph comprehension. And the way that you wanna handle it is like this. You will actually not start with the passage after the question. No, you won't. What you're gonna do is you're actually gonna use the answer choices to your advantage. Why? Because it's a sequence of events. This is super, super, super logical. This is basically saying, hey, what happens first? What happens second, third, fourth, etc." And if we look at the answer choices that we're given, just take a look at them. So before we continue, if you like the way that we're presenting this information about paragraph comprehension, but you're still feeling frustrated because you don't think that you have enough practice and enough guidance, that's what our program is for. In our program, you're gonna get access to our Paragraph Comprehension Bootcamp, which offers over 200 practice questions. That way, you can go ahead and practice the right way and build your confidence up. And on top of that, you're gonna get access to over 100 recorded lessons for Paragraph Comprehension, going through more problems, going through those strategies. That way, you have enough content to take you from where you are to the score that you need. So, check the link out in the description of this video. That way, you can learn how to stress less, score higher, and get the job you deserve. Let's get back to the video, but don't forget, click that link and see how you can raise your score. Take a look. We have A being Lan's daughter asks why she can't see her picture. Then we see, oh, another one again in C, Lan's daughter asks why she can't see her picture. Then we also see other choices like this one. Lan creates the polarization filter. And we also see this one over here. Lan wants to build an instant camera. So think about it like this. If we're looking at a sequence of events, one of these has to happen first, right? One of them has to happen first. And so your objective right now, simply put, is to figure out whether the daughter asks why she can't see her picture, creating a polarization filter, or building an instant camera. Which one of those actually comes first? Because when you find out which one of those comes first, you can eliminate all of the other choices. And sometimes you might be able to find that in as quickly as 30 seconds. You have two minutes per question on the paragraph comprehension, two minutes. And so you can use this to your advantage really, really easily. So let's go ahead and get to it. So what we're going to do again, just to remind you the strategy here for sequence of events, start with the choices and then you're going to mark them and say, okay, why we can't see the picture polarization filter wants to build an instant camera. I skip C because it's the same as a, so I'm going to go back into the passage now and see which one of those happens first. So, Inspired by his daughter, who'd asked why she couldn't immediately see the photo of Dr. Edwin Land had taken of her. Okay, so again, the color that we used here was pink. So let me just mark that right there. Asked why she couldn't see, immediately see, the photo that, the, that Dr. Land had taken of her right there. Okay, but we're going to keep reading because we want to know what happens first. Just because it's shown first does not mean it's what happens first. Remember, I could say today... I ate cereal and yesterday I had filet mignon. You know, I could say that what happens first, the filet mignon, because it was yesterday. So it's about the sequence. It's about the timeline here. 
So with that said, let's take a look here. Polarization filter and instant camera are what we're looking for now. So let's keep reading. Lance started playing around with the idea of the instant camera. So again, inspired by his daughter, who would ask why she couldn't see the picture, Lance started playing around with the idea of the instant camera. Okay, so he started trying to build it right there. So what color was that? That was blue. So right here, started playing around with the idea of the instant camera. Okay, then it says, it had been over a decade. It had been over a decade since he created the polarization filter and took uh, his daughter's prompt for Land to create his first instant camera called the Model 95. Huh. So this is going to be pretty interesting. I see it right there in green. It says here, he created the polarization filter. And it says it had been over a decade. What does that mean? What it means is, think about it like this. If I just gave you a different situation. If I said, hey, today I, uh, I rode my bike. Uh, I, I rode my bike today and it was immediately after uh, my mom asked me why I wasn't working out. It had been over five years since uh, the first tricycle I ever rode. So in that situation, it had been 10 years since I did this. That happened first. The tricycle happened first. And so here it says, look, it had been over a decade, over 10 years since he created the filter. And now we're talking about his daughter asking why she couldn't see the photo. And so he started trying to build the instant camera. But what happens first? He created the polarization filter that happened a decade ago. Today, the daughter asked why she couldn't see the picture. And because Lance saw that, he started tinkering with the idea of the instant camera, which he did build, um, and it's called the Model 95. 19, or 1895 is when it was released. And just like you're watching this video for free here on YouTube, I got more free materials for you, my ass bad party people. We've got a free practice test that comes with video solutions so you can learn from every single mistake and identify those topics that you need to crush and work on. And on top of that, you can get a free class with me on Zoom once a week. And so that's all included in my free practice test with my free class included. Click that link in this video or in the description, sign up, keep learning for free and keep raising your score. I'm proud of you. Let's keep working hard and let's get back to the problem. And so with that said, everybody, right there, B. B is the answer because Land creates the polarization filter that happens first. What happens next? The daughter asks why she can't immediately see her picture. That's right there, number two. And then after that, then he's like, okay, well, you can't see your photo. Oh man, this is taking too long. Then let me go ahead and start tinkering with an instant camera. Oh, right over here. And then after that, boom, the Model 95 was born and was created. And so there it is. That's why B is the answer. This is a sequence of events question in paragraph comprehension. So go ahead, let me know in the comments. Did you like this? Like, did you like this strategy here? Did you, do you see how it can save us time in the long run? And again, we're hosting a class on this the day that this video drops at 6 p.m. Eastern time. Again, for paragraph comprehension, two whole hours of great practice so that way you can raise your score and ace the ASVAC. So if you wanna get rid of that test anxiety, again, use that link right there. Use the link in the description, but make sure to check it out. Sign up if you wanna get the best absolute training you can for the ASVAB, so that way you can get the military job you deserve. Again, I'm Anderson, your ASVAB coach, and I'll see you in the next video. See you. And as always, my party people, thanks for watching. You can subscribe with that button right there, and you can also see a link to a video just like this one right up there. But most importantly, if you want the program and you wanna raise your score the right way, every step of the way with my support, there's that link at the bottom left. Go ahead, click that link, watch the video on how the program works, subscribe and raise your score.